Booktube, you welcome back to my channel today I'm back with another video from my on the shelf series which is probably a mistitled series because usually when I present books that are on the shelf the shelf is really a table but it's a game that I play whenever I go to the bookstore and whoever is lucky or unlucky enough to have accompanied me there we play this game which is to see from a randomly assorted collection of books how many of these books have I read and can you beat my number so here's some footage from my recent trip to the Barnes & Noble on the Upper West Side and as I'm reading the titles of the books I'll tell you which of these I've read and at the end of course I'll give you my tally and I'd love to know if you've read more of the books on this table than I have so here we go. Here is some favorite paperback books. We start with Amor Toll's Rules of Civility, Need to Know by Karen Cleveland, Haruki Murakami, Men Without Women, If I Understood You Would I Have This Look on My Face by Alan Alda, The Alienist by Caleb Carr, Colson Whitehead's The Underground Railroad and Home Going by Yagi Yassi, both of those I've read, Tana French's In the Woods, no. Leanne Moriarty, What Alice Forgot, I read. Gillian Flynn's Dark Places, I have not read, but Gillian Flynn's Sharp Objects, I have read. Also, A Holes by Erin James and Killers of the Flower Moon by David Grant, I have not read. On the second tier, we have Watch Me Disappear by Janelle Brown, Behold the Dreamers by Imbola Bewey, The Alienist by Caleb Carr, again, Dark Matter by Blake Crouch, Station Eleven by Emily St. John Mandel, The Girl in the Tower by Catherine Arden, Evicted by Matthew Desmond, No, The Little Paris Bookshop by Nina George, I read recently, Spoonbenders by Daryl Gregory, No, Everything I Never Told You by Celeste Ng, I have read, and Edgar Cantero's Meddling Kids, I have not read, but I have read Gone Girl by Gillian Flynn. I have not read John Grisham's Camino Island or Artemis by Andy Weir or Reincarnation Blues by Michael Poor or Love and Other Constellation Prizes by Jamie Ford, but I have read Lincoln and the Bardo by George Saunders. No to Silk Rose by Peter Francoren, but I have read BJ Novak's short story collection, One More Thing. I have not read Eligible by Curtis Siddenfield or Carol S. Dweck, PhD's Mindset, nor Richard Dawkins' Science of the Soul sadly. House of Echoes by Brendan Duffy I also have not read, neither have I read Nancy Thayer's Secrets in Summer. Bonfire by Kristen Ritter, no. Joe Nesbo the Thirst, no, but I have read Big Little Lies by Leon Moriarty. Anita Shrives, The Stars Are Fire, no. Fitness Junkie by Lucy Skies and Joe Piazza, no. The Story of Arthur Truloy by Elizabeth Berg, no. Alexander McCall Smith's The House of Unexpected Sisters, no. The Couple Next Door by Shari Lapina, no. Sophie Kinsella Surprised Me, no. Spool of Blue Thread by Ann Tyler, no. But I have read The Vegetarian by Han Kang. And J. Henrik's How to Argue with a Cat, sadly, no. So I've read 11 books from this assortment. Let me know in the comments how many you've read. I hope you've beat my number. That means that this assortment has been prepared, especially for you and you win again <laughs> i love playing i hope you do too if you like this video give me a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and we'll talk in the comments and until next time happy reading